Riaba Sakatalia. When God is ready to bless you, when God is ready to change your story, when God is ready to lift you up, He sends favor to you. So, therefore, I prophesy upon everyone's life here this morning that the favor of the Lord will come upon you in the name of Jesus. He did a prayer first. And the prayer is in Nehemiah chapter 1, verse 6. Nehemiah chapter 1, verse 6. When you are in sin, you can't see favor. When you are in equity, favor will be far from you. When you are running out of unrighteousness, favor will not come to you. So therefore, Nehemiah prayed. He said, please let your ears be attentive and your eyes be open." that you may hear the prayer of your servant, which I pray before you now, day and night, for the children of Israel, your servant, and confess the sins of the children of Israel, which they have sinned against you. Both my father's house and I have sinned. Before Pebble spoke, he asked for mercy. Before Pebble spoke, right? Before Pebble spoke he confessed his sin. So therefore, I want us to use the next few minutes to begin to confess our sin to our Father. Begin to ask for mercy and say, Father, I have mercy upon me this morning, O Lord. I have mercy upon us this morning, O Lord. Everything that will hinder, that will hinder our favor, everything that will not allow God to look up to us favorably, ask for mercy this morning, ask for forgiveness of sin. My career does not come my may my pray for favor. He may my pray, but before he asks for favor, he asks for forgiveness of sin. The precious blood of Jesus. Ask for the mercy of God. The Father have mercy upon us this one, Lord. Let the heaven of mercy, let the heaven of mercy, let the heaven of mercy open for us this one, Lord. The mercy that we attract favor, the mercy that we release favor. Makoria basa kotalia, reka basa kota kapalia, magiba kota kapale, reka basa kotalia. Reka pata de kokoria, mali kapo seke tekele, reka pasa katale, reka pasa katale, and for the favor of God, cry for his favor this morning, cry for his favor this morning, let the air back to the basu katalea, is the katalea, let mercy open the door, let mercy open the door, let mercy open the door, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. We want to ask for the fresh fire of God. When you want to ask for favor, you need empowerment. He said in Ephesians chapter 4, verse 20, the one who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, more than what we ask, more than what we think, more than what we imagine, and according to the power in us, when you want to want to speak in your life, you need the power of God. That is what Scripture said to Mary that the Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the highest will overshadow you. You need power to attract favor. Makoria basakatalia, power that will draw favor to your destiny, power that will draw favor to your career, power that will draw favor to your, to your destiny. Revelation chapter 20. Revelation chapter 20, verse 9b. It says, And fire came down from God out of heaven and devoured her. Fire came out of that is opened. And fire came down. I want us to cry to God this morning. I say, Father, let my heaven of favor open. Let my heaven of favor open. In the name of Jesus. In the name 
This money, all the heaven of paper for me. This year is going to an end. This year is going to an end. The Lord, the heaven of paper, the heaven of paper. Let the fire of God come down and remove the paper of one. Let the fire of God come down. My children, open up for open for that church. So favor, so favor, so favor. My cowl by black talent. My open up favor, open for me by fire. My open up favor, open for me by fire. In the name of Jesus, please cry to God, cry to God, cry to God. My life capacity. When every open favor is released. Oh God, to open your heaven of favor in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Psalm 5, verse 12 says, We're asking for favor. Favor gives you what you are not entitled for. Favor, favor is like a perfume. Anywhere you go, people are attracted to you. When a woman puts on perfume, you can't but not notice her. That is when someone carries favor. You can't see someone that carries favor and not notice them. Everywhere they go, favor, they are, they are noticed. That is why when Esther entered, they said everyone that saw Esther wanted to favor her. I profess something upon your life this morning. After the seven day prayer, everybody that feeds you, everybody that meets with you, with you, we begin to pray for you in the name of Jesus. And everybody saw sister and they wanted to favor her from today. Enjoy your children. They will favor them in the name of Jesus. My Korea master, your name from today is favor. Your name from today is favor. Your life that is lacking favor. Your life that is lacking favor. Whether your career, whether your ministry, whether your marriage, the we will locate you now in the name of Jesus. Look at Psalm 5, verse 12. It says, For you, O Lord, we bless the righteous. With favor, you will surround him as with a shield. Favors around me. My career, my support, my company. He said he will surround us with favor and the shield. That is, your front carry favor, your back carry favor, your legs carry favor, your right carry favor. Fifteen of the favor. Things are hard, it will be easy for that person. I want us to cry to God. 
He said, favor will surround us as a shield. Surrounding means that there is no place in your life when something surrounds you, that means there is no space for penetration. Mm -hmm. So when God says he surrounds us with favor, that is to say there is no area of your life that will not enjoy favor. I want us to pray. This nation that I am in, this nation, you will eat the good of the land. One of the obedience is to ask for favor. You will eat the good of the land. Now, Lord, this nation that I am in, let me enjoy your favor round about. Let me enjoy your favor round about. Begin to cry to God. Begin to cry to God. My God, you have a let me enjoy your favor in this nation. Whether you are in Nigeria, whether you are in the United Kingdom, whether you are in the United States, whether you are in the United States, right to God, your soul has your food, your feet, and fat senator. Thou Lord, let me speak for me. Let me speak for me. Let me speak for me. My God, my soul, my God, my God. We are praying. I decree over your life this morning. Jesus. When favor surrounds a man, it's like a perfume. I pray for everyone's destiny this morning. From the perfume of favor, the perfume of favor, we begin to speak in your home. We begin to speak in your family. We begin to speak in your business. We begin to speak in your career. We begin to speak in this right now for you. I think if I'm today, you will be a fair favor. I think I can see you. Those people that have said that they will not favor you because of your prayer this morning, they are not in change. They will favor you. Those that have forgotten you for, for favor. I will be there. Of remembrance, remember you today for favor. Don't remember you and forget you because of favor. We remember you this morning that they love Jesus. Look at Exodus chapter 3, verse 21. Favor eradicates emptiness. Favor eradicates emptiness. The children of Israel were empty, slaves in the land. But when God looked unto them favorably, emptiness disappeared. The salary that they hold the Israelites, the Egyptian paid everything. Imagine someone working for 400 years, no salary. I mean, one day they paid that salary. Please calculate it to the time of today. If someone pays you, let's assume. That is even 100 pounds a month that we are giving you. 400 years of payment. Oh, you need that scripture, they said gold and silver. The one that they do, God collected everything for them. When the war is speaking, what is that whole thing? They will not be the religion to you in the name of Jesus. They might think they have cheated you, they might think they have gone far. But the God of favor, that favor the Israelites will visit your home. Amen. To favor you in the name of Jesus. He says, and I will give the people favor in the sight of the Egyptian. And it shall be, when you go, you shall not go empty. Yes. You will not go empty this year in the name of Jesus. Amen. This month of October, you will not leave it empty in the name of Jesus. 
As you are entering the month of November, you will not enter anything in the name of Jesus. Before the end of this year, you will not enter anything in the name of Jesus. And the world of Christ of God has said, Fall down, lock up your table, and you can't anything left in my life. You can't anything left in my life. In the name of Jesus, please eradicate my finances. Go eradicate it. will not go anything. Go Mighty name, we are praying. Someone said that even if Devora visits the finances of MK or Abiora, that that Devora will die in it. That is to say, there is a favor that speak upon a man's destiny that Devora cannot eat up. Makuria basikatiria bakuria masakutalia. I speak to your finances today. The pocket where you are taking your finances from, I decree it will not be empty in the name of Jesus. As you are taking it out, the host of heaven will refill it back. You cannot run out. From today, voice of God is funny. You will not run out in the name of Jesus. Your final thing, but the grace of God and both them to the mercy of God to be done for you in the name of Jesus. In Jesus, mighty name, we are praying. Look at that Exodus 3:22. Favor does not just eradicate emptiness, favor allows all your requests to be granted. Have you seen anywhere in scripture? That God says someone carry favor and they rejected that person. Have you seen? Have you seen? So, therefore, I charge someone this morning what they say cannot be done, what they say that it is not possible, what they say that I have no before this land. I decree that the favor of God will make it possible for you that I want Jesus. I saw scripture, I did not see rejection on a man that carry favor. Even at the point of someone that they wanted, if you enter that room, you are dead. But because she carried favor, she entered that room. Instead of death, it was promotion. Ha! Hey, Olua, Holy Ghost, everyone moving with you. Let favor turn their life around in the name of Jesus. Look at what they said. Exodus chapter 3, verse 32. Say, but every woman shall ask of her neighbor, namely of her. Who dwells near a house, articles of silver, articles of gold, and clothing, and you shall put them on your sons and your daughter, so you shall plunder the Egyptian. Your neighbor. What it means is that because you carry favor. Did you see? Understand. Favor is upon someone. The enemy that puts you under bondage for 400 years. You are going to ask them for gold and they gave it to you. You are going to ask them for silver and they gave it to you. Is that logically, is it possible? Is it possible? But when, when favor is upon a man, all your requests are granted. I think upon everyone's life this morning, all your requests according to the will of God, favor will be granted for you in the name of Jesus. You want to cry to God? The Father, grant all my requests by your favor. Grant 
all my requests by your favor. I don't know what you are asking God, but favor is the favor rejection. Favor is no tenure. We are praying. He says, ask your neighbor. What it means is that anybody that is beside you or around you, don't be afraid to ask. Don't be afraid to ask. Scripture says in Matthew chapter 7, ask and you shall receive. We immediately you carry favor. Don't be afraid to ask. He said, ask your neighbor. If it's the president of a nation that is beside you, ask. Body that is within you or around you, ask them what you want. I want car. I want house. Because favor does not carry rejection. I'm here to tell you this morning that favor is the word of God. Look at what scripture says in Isaiah 55 verse 10. For as the rain comes down and the snow from heaven and do not return there, but water the head and make it to bring forth and board that it may give seed to the sower. And bread to the either. So shall my word, my word that is favor. So shall my word, my word that is favor. That God's word, shall not return to you void. It shall accomplish what I please, and it shall prosper in the things for which I sent it. It is the word of God. Look to you favorably. So therefore, you request today. You request before the end of this year. It will only come back to you, void in the name of Jesus. It will come back to you, accept it in the name of Jesus. They will not carry rejection. You will not see rejection again. Amen. You will not see rejection again. I want you to move with assurance. No more rejection. No more disappointment. No more failure. No more shame at the end of breakthrough. Because we carry the ball. He says he will not return back to you, boy. That house they say you cannot buy. I decree, as you ask in the next seven days, he will not return back to you, boy, in the name of Jesus. Have you seen Lord changing for someone overnight? I have seen Lord changes because of favor. Please move with that understanding today. The Lord say I should taste to us. That don't be afraid to ask. Don't be afraid to ask. That brother, that uncle, that auntie, that friend, ask them. And you will be granted in the name of Jesus. Amen. You will be granted in the name of Jesus. Amen. You will be granted in the name of Jesus. Look at the word of God. Isaiah 60, verse 5. Isaiah 60, verse 5. Verse 5b. The wealth of the Gentile shall come to you. And I'll say it to myself, I don't know about you. The wealth of the Gentile shall come to me. Favor draws wealth. Favor draws wealth. Have you seen the level? Ah, I'm going to pray that tomorrow. Moses' mother. They are paying our salary. To look after our own son. From today, what you are not entitled to, what you will usually do for free, what you will usually do for charity, they will pay you double for it in the name of Jesus. I want us to cry to the Lord last time. The Lord let never draw the wealth of the Gentiles to me. Let never draw the wealth of the Gentiles to me. Let never draw the wealth of the Gentiles to me. In the name of Jesus, favor, favor, 
the wealth of the Gentiles for me. Draw the wealth of the Gentiles for me. In the name of Jesus, pray for draw the wealth of the Gentiles. Makaraba soko takaya, makalebo soko takaya. In Jesus' name, we are praying. The wealth of the Gentiles, the Lord will draw it to you. From today, those of us in the foreign land, you will begin to eat like citizens. You will begin to drink like citizens. We are you for citizens of the nation you are in. The Lord will release this to your hand in the name of Jesus. As Esther became queen in a foreign land, as Daniel became a god in a foreign land, he declared God of in a foreign land. The Lord will lift you up there in the name of Jesus. For citizens, for this that they said that it's only for the children of the land, because you carry favor. That position, the Lord will take you there. Even as much he can take us there, he will take you there. In that body, when you are in, the Lord will promote you. The Lord will promote your children. The greatest of favor begin to work in your life. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Let us begin to appreciate the King of Glory. Let us begin to appreciate God for the day one. That Lord, we thank you. Everlasting Father, we thank you, Lord. I carry favor. I carry favor. I carry favor. Makare basa katalia. Appreciate God. Appreciate God. Appreciate God this morning. Say, Father, we thank you in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Remember, if you are not in Christ, you are in crisis. If you are here, you have not given your life to Jesus, I will encourage you to run to him. Nobody that is outside Christ that carries favor. The Lord Almighty, we bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's share the grace in fellowship. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God the Father, the of the Holy Spirit, abide with us now forever. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. A shout hallelujah to the Lord of Lord. Hallelujah. Amen.